Coming up on Midco Sports tonight, highlights from last night's Summit League matchup between Omaha and SDSU. Then it's all things NSIC hoops. David Brown is in studio to get us up to speed on the Northern Sun. And finally, get to know South Dakota women's hoops junior guard Allison Arns in Coyote Q&A. All of that plus much more, Midco Sports tonight tips off right now. Hello and happy Wednesday, everyone. I'm Kelly Stewart, and this is Midco Sports Tonight. Well, last night live right here on Midco SN, the SDSU men's basketball team began the second half of league play, welcoming Omaha to Frost Arena. The Jacks had beaten the Mavs down in Omaha earlier this month, and we're looking for a great performance to complete the season. Sweet, pretty good crowd cracking Frost Arena on Tuesday night and they would get their money's worth right away. Tevin King finds a seam, lays it in. Over 6'8", Matt Pyle jacks on the board first, two to nothing. A few minutes later, King to Dom. The defense bites on the shot fake, and he goes in for the nice little floater. South Dakota State up by eight. Dom had six of SDSU's first 12 points, but Omaha settling in. JT Gibson to Zach Janks Jackson right there for the easy lay-in. Mavs within three, and then just over 10 minutes to go. More from Omaha. Jackson with the drive, the double clutch in the air. But for the remainder of the highlights, you'll see a lot of Mike Dom. He had an outstanding game, posting up there for a little hook shot. That's good for two. Another hook shot, another two, the same block. But the coaches always talk about working the inside out game. David Jenkins Jr. goes out to Brandon Key. He has time to think about that one, but he knocks it down. Final seconds, Dom off the glass and in. He had 20 points in the first half alone, and SDSU is leading 44 to 28. Now looking to the second half. Well, he started the first half right away for SDSU. It's Tevin King again getting the first points on the board. Nice little left-handed lay-in, but let's take a look at the guy who always had a bucket to keep Omaha going. Zach Jansen, nice baseline feed, rises up, knocks down the three, but for the rest of this one, it's pretty much all number 24 for SDSU. Mike Dom posting up on the defense, power dribble right here. Gets a little rebound after a block, and then under three minutes to go in the game. Brandon Key on the drive, spins, they're just kidding. That's Dirk Nowitzki right there. Fadeaway action, if you will, but no, that is Mike Dom sinking the bucket. SDSU completes the regular season sweep of Omaha, 80 to 60, the final from Frost. Dom, 35 points, 18 boards. That's his 24th career double-double. Tevin King added 14 for SDSU. Skyler Flatten chipped in 12. South Dakota State remains atop the Summit League standings at 7-1. They'll take on North Dakota State in Brookings tomorrow night, live right here on Midco SN. First of all, congratulations, Coach. That is the 13th double-double of the season for Mike Dom in another game over 30 points. How has he been so consistent all year? Yeah, I think he did a great job tonight running the rim in transition. We got him some post touches early. He's very intentional about his catches down there and scoring. And I thought our guys did a great job looking for him and getting the ball, and he did a great job finishing. And Tevin King with the dunks. How did that get the energy flowing early in the first? Yeah, Tevin was outstanding. I mean, his play at the point guard position tonight was phenomenal. He really quarterbacked our team. Uh, those dunks are big time energy plays. Tevin's so important to our team, does so many great things, and just really proud of him for what he brought tonight. And another rivalry game against NDSU on Thursday. What's the recovery looking like for the next two days? Yeah, we've got to turn it around quick. Uh, you know, so we'll figure out what we'll do tomorrow to get prepared uh, for the Bison. We know they're really good. They're playing well. So uh, we've got a lot to work on the next 48 hours. Get ready for that game. Congratulations again. Thanks a lot. All right, when we come back, we'll switch gears to the NSIC. David Brown joins me in studio to recap the weekend on the hardwood. This is Midco Sports Tonight. Midco Sports Tonight, presented by Avera Orthopedics.